right, so memory plan's a little different today. I had created this, and I just really couldn't post anything, you guys. So I do have two weeks created, and then maybe next week we'll get back to creating them together. And um, that was because, you remember, I was going through some things. <laughs> and so this is the last one we created together. And the 7th through the 13th, this was the bad week. This was the day that everything went down at my soon-to-be um, old job. <laughs> and I just didn't, I just couldn't get past it mentally. Um, but I did have some creations for Brutus Monroe. My husband made me comfort food because he is awesome. My dog comforted me. It was a design team, uh, one of my last ones for Confessions of a Paper Addict. I, I have, um, I will not be on the Confessions of a Paper Addict design team for this term. I will also not be on the Stamper's Delight um, design team. Uh, hopefully in the future I can rejoin, but as of now, um, I'm just going to stick with Brutus Monroe. This was my Brutus Monroe Live that week, and uh, the Craft O'Clock, so fabulous companies, and I still have Brutus Monroe's a year term, and Craft O'Clock, I still have to finish out the term, so um, this was when I was doing the budget, and I was going to use $50 fake money, but with the job switching and everything that's going to go on, the budgeting on my channel is going to be gone until probably May, maybe the end of April, and that is just because everything is so up in the air. Um, we are doing some things, and, um, obviously I am increasing my pay, so we will kind of show how that all pans out, um, but I don't know if I'll even be doing cash stuffing. I think I'm going to be doing, like, a cashless cash stuffing so that I just save it in my savings account, because I really didn't like having that much cash, and, you know, so... Uh, but with this new job, things are good. They're going to be so great, you guys, and when I share this with you. But obviously there is going to be a period um, where I may not have a paycheck for a while. Uh, just because I'm going to um, salary and I get paid twice a month at my new job. So it's the 15th and the last day of the month. So i got to try to figure out how to do that. And I will still be held accountable, but I will tell you by... Um, May, all of my debt will be paid off. Um, everything that I was working towards, the consolidation loan that we did, every, all of that we are wiping out in the next 30 days, which is awesome. So all my credit cards, all of that stuff that I had previously worked, and all of the savings and stuff, that is going to be a whole new chapter in my life, and we will take that journey together. So this was Be Watching TV. Because uh, she wasn't feeling good. Uh, this was for my class, the Mix in the Media 2 class. I did another review um, for Amazon. There's a company out there that sends me some adhesive products, and I did a review of this glue gun. Excellent! And then I even used these little things in the right context. If you've seen here, I kind of used them like that, and that was actually that first week was when I realized what they were supposed to be used for, but I had already sealed them together. So I did use them in the right context here. And then this is the 14th through the 20th. And this is with stuff that I really couldn't share. Uh, because I did put my new job in stuff because this was the date. This was the week that I started doing interviews, in-person interviews, and going to companies and getting badges and stuff. So my craft o'clock creation that was photos only for them. Um, one of the people that I'm going to miss the most at my current job sent me a unicorn farting rainbows or something to make me smile because she's my she is currently my boss. But um, Scrappy Kathy's Hop, the month and how I did on YouTube, the two sketches that I put out this week for my class, the selfie that I took waiting um, for another callback on a job, the mixed media mayhem. <laughs> My best friend in the entire world. I've been best friends with her since grade school. We send stupid stuff to each other all the time, and we're like huge Golden Girl fans. Um, so she just sent me this to make me smile through this whole process. Everything I was going through it was like everything I need to know. I learned from Rose, Blanche, Dorothy, and Sophia. Um, I collect collect these pins. Um, 
like the, the hat pins or whatever they are. I have a whole board that's got them up there. Even the ones from um, the company that I'm leaving collected over the years. They call them, what, lapel pins or something like that. Robbie found one of Bush Stadium here in St. Louis, you know, Cardinals baseball. So I, he found that and gave it to me. And I was like, yay, and there's my cool flower pants. Um, so, yeah. So that is, this is my Bruce Monroe layout. And just, uh, you know, not a lot going on. This week here is going to be filled to the brim um, because, you know, I quit my job <laughs> and I did all that stuff. So um, a lot of, like, celebrations. Um, I guess the one thing that I don't have on here. Oh, no. Yeah, this one. Yeah, okay, because this is... I hadn't quit my job yet. I apologize. This is still the week I didn't. We went to the Blues game, but if you've seen me scrap, and I started to scrap those in a 12 by 12. So I'll be having pictures from the Blues game on there and all kinds of fun stuff that we did this week. And then actually um, on Wednesday we went to the Elton John farewell tour. So that'll be... So there's just so much going on. Um, we are... And we're planning, like, you know, June we're taking vacation with uh, his family um, we're also going to take a weekend trip to Chicago to see the Grateful Dead playing concert. But those tickets don't go on sale yet, so <laughs> we're waiting. So, I mean, just things like that. Our life is, uh, the changes and everything that I went through in the last few, you know, the last month or so where I was just, just really upset. I want to appreciate, I want you to, to know I appreciate each and every one of you and all my lovely friends and all of you that have reached out to me and just to, you know, Thumbs up, keep going. You know, I mean, most of you didn't know what was going on, but you were very encouraging and you helped me. You did help me get through a very challenging time. Um, I learned my self worth in the process, and I can't. That is just immeasurable to me, um, and I appreciate each and every one of you. Uh, it was these decisions that we made and that I was pretty much forced into making um, in a way, because I am a firm believer. Um, that if you are not happy with something in your life, it is up to you and you alone to change it. Um, Robbie could sit here and talk with me, my mom, my friends, like my, my close, my circle could tell me, like, you know, this is what they think. But it was really up to me. And even at work when I was talking to Stephanie and I was just, like, telling her, I was like, you know, I'm upset with the changes and it's fine. I was like, but it's not on anybody now. It's on me and what I do. And... I, ha I have to do this. I have to make myself happy. And she, you know, totally understood. Um, at this point, they didn't know that I had already been having interviews and stuff because obviously you can't do that. You can't say that. Um, but in the end, these changes, they are going, they are life-changing. They are going to make Rob's and I life so much better, which in turn will make our children's life better. Um, you know, the $2,500 to $3,000 that these surgery is going to cost, we don't have to save up for. We'll just be able to, you know, hopefully get things taken care of. And, you know, I may fall flat on my face, um, but I think I deserve the opportunity to try. However, <laughs> everyone pretty much says you're not going to fall on your face. Only There was only one person that said you might, and that's because he's hurt that he's the reason that, you know, th that this happened. But that's neither here nor there. And there are some hurt feelings for me with this one individual. Um, but after Friday, the what? The eighth. I will never have to deal with it again. So <laughs> I am super excited and happy. I want to thank you all for taking this journey with me. Hopefully, we can get back to getting these scrapped. My husband always says, like, are you really going to want to look back and like what you were doing? And I'm like, I will care about you guys. <laughs> so that is going to do it for my memory album today. Um, I will have affiliate links down below if you want to pick any of this stuff up. To, you know, Ranger, Tonic Studios, um, a cherry on top, which is where I pick up my happy planners, um, Glassboard Studios, which if you use the code Rebecca20, you will get... 20% uh, off your entire purchase. Um, Brutus Monroe, all the fun places. I will have a store link to a company that does sell the craft o'clock because a lot of people have asked that. That is not an affiliate link for me. I just try to provide you guys. Like if you click on 
the craft o'clock one I don't get any kind of commissions but that's what the affiliate links are um, but the craft o'clock one is just to give you a place where to buy that because it is a Polish company and it's fabulous and I am super excited to receive my next package of their newest release I'm so excited sorry I get giddy about those things um I've been doing really well on my low spend um just, and trying to use up the stash. If you guys want to join in on the stash shiving Tuesdays, if you guys have a YouTube channel, you are more than welcome to play along. Just drop me or Scrappy Adam a line. Uh, we'll invite you over to the message group where you can just kind of hang out with us and do stash dive Tuesdays. Um, also, Scrap Dump, which is the, I think it's the first Tuesday of the month now. It's so random that we had, we have, it's like a random hop, but then yet random on the days because you know me and Adam. If you guys want to play along with that, you're more than welcome to. I will also have my Facebook group down below. I am hoping to get to 500. Um, so that'll be fun. And I do sell close to my heart products. I just ran a promo, so uh, stay tuned for that as well. Anybody that had bought something from me in March, you guys are going to be getting gifts. I've got to order those today, and I'm just going to ship them directly to you because I feel like that's just less time and hassle for me. Um, so I do run promotions on my Facebook group a lot, so don't forget to check that out. Um, I often like to send thank you gifts. I, To be honest, I sell it for the discount that I get on the products, and they do have a fabulous array of mixed media and stuff as such. So uh, I don't really do it to make the money off the commission, so that's why I kind of give away free gifts and stuff, so stay tuned for that. So, I do want to remind you that I love you and I appreciate each and every one of you. Remember to always be kind and I'll check you later with another video.